as part of exercise 4 we have to create node port service for our metadata service deployed as a replica set and use your node IP and node port to post meta entries and try to get them. Let's get started. As part of this exercise, I'm going to use exactly the same replica set that I created in previous exercise. Just use it. I'm going to create another descriptor YAML for service. The kind is service. The name of the service is metadata SVC. Remember, this is the name that will be used for the DNS access also. The type is node port. Select a label that I'm specifying is app metadata pod. And there's the same label given to my metadata pod as well. One of the key point here is that I'm specifying the node port that I want to exactly configure, which is 32323. If you don't specify the node port, it will pick up one of the random port. So let's start. First, let me deploy the service. So I'm deploying a service, metadata service. Since we don't have any pods running with the given labels, we don't have any endpoint register here. However, the service is created of type node port and the IP cluster IP is also given. So every node port service is also having a cluster IP and port. However, if you want to access through node port, the port is 32323. So internally, every node port service is cluster IP service also. So now let's deploy the replica set. So I'm watching on the replica set here. Both are up and running, however, in not in ready state. As soon as this ready state is updated here, both the endpoints of the IP will get added into the endpoints. See this? It's ready and both the endpoints are added here. We are good. As part of the service, I would like to access my service using DNS name. So to do that, let me first deploy a DNS util pod and from that pod I will try to access using DNS name because DNS names are only available from one pod to another pod, not available even on the node or outside. So I have my DNS util pods. So I have my DNS util pod up and running. kubectl exec. Now I am inside the DNS util pod. In just to wgate on my actuator info using the metadata service name. See the response is coming. I hit a number of times, it's still working fine. So using your service name, you can access. Now let's try to access this using node port. So first I need to get the minikube IP. That's my IP. You can do simple curl minikube IP followed by port 32323 slash metadata. I'll get it empty. So because there is no entry there. Now let's try to do a couple of posts. Submitted, one meta entry created. Submitted, second meta entry created. Let's try to do the get again. You notice we did not receive any response. When I tried again, it returned two entries. Try again, it's random, right? The reason for this is we are using embedded MongoDB inside our metadata service pod. So each of pod is having their own database. When I tried to do the post, the post went to particular one of the pod. Both the posts went to one of the pod. And only that pod is returning me the data. Otherwise, empty list. So that's the problem now. Let's solve this problem in the next exercise.